Hello and welcome again to River Art Gallery and Gifts. Today in the galleries, we are featuring our current show, the Buffalo Niagara Art Association Fall Exhibition. There are also many new pieces in the store as we head through to the exhibition galleries. River Art Gallery is now open for up to eight people at a time on Friday and Saturday from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. As with all of our works of art, we represent Western New York artists as solo artists in group shows and regional art society exhibitions. Starting on the green west wall, we have a watercolor by Diane Goupel titled Mallard Duck. The pastel beneath that painting is by Donna Hale and is called Beaver Island Inlet. To the right of both is a watercolor from Jean McDonald's vintage series titled Go Away, Mister. On the pedestal rounding the corner is Joan Langley Shaw's oil, Canal Days. Facing the north wall is Dreams of the Northwest, a watercolor by Jean Jane. Next is another watercolor titled Tagged. This one is by Jane Stoddard. Here's an acrylic by William McCullough he calls Tom's T2. Beneath that is a Deborah Meyer watercolor titled Hashtag for Kassir. Anchoring the north wall is Curtsy, an acrylic painting by Marie Prince. Then we have An Angel in Oil by Judy Puffpaff, Raise Your Eyes, Genesis 1314. Another oil below that is The Graduation Party 2020 by Michelle Marcotte. The final piece on the north wall in Gallery 1 is Buffalo Skyway, a plain air oil by Paula Jurek. As we turn to enter Gallery 2, we see a small oil by Dennis Bertram, Pan 6. As we turn into the back gallery, we see a small colored pencil piece by Nikki Milley titled Tasty. On the corner pedestal is a work in oil by Michelle Marcotte. It is Ken and I picked cherries from our tree in early July. Facing north again is Pan 3 by Dennis Bertram, which is oil and gold leaf. Then we have a watercolor titled Sun Shower Chanticleer by Deborah Meyer. To the right is a small oil by Joan Langley Shaw, she calls Niagara Escarpment Sunrise. Underneath, we find an Alcott oil titled Sunset at Cow Pasture Pond, Archer, Florida, by Ken Vick. Past the green door, we have an acrylic by William McCullough, Not Our Maggie. Beneath it is a Brian Berberick acrylic, work titled Unrestricted Seas. The last two pieces on the north wall are Lily Pond at Reinstein Woods, a plein air pastel by Castrofano, and a Donahale landscape and pastel named Don't Turn Your Back. Facing south now is Paula Jurek's oil painting, Barely Rooted. Then we have a large acrylic called It's a Jungle Out There from Enid Edelman. Following that is Wintry Ledge, a mixed media work by Paula Borkowski. Here is Nikki Millie's colored pencil piece she calls Buffalo Chill. Still looking south is Quiet Woods, a watercolor from Manning McCandlish. Another watercolor is next by Diane Goupil. It is titled Canada Geese. Two more watercolors complete the back gallery. They are by Jane Stoddard, Making Arrangements,
and Jean Jane Dreaming of Banff. Heading around the corner to Gallery 1 again and facing east is a plein air pastel by Castrofano called Appropriately Which Way is East? In the center of the east wall are two works by Cheryl Perez. The top piece is a watercolor titled Sunflower Sunshine and another watercolor called Lacy Leaves in Summer. Here is Jean McDonald's watercolor titled Dolly. Now we are looking south again to an acrylic titled Dancing with the Waves by Enid Edelman. Next is a collage called Fences by Maureen Matthews. In the middle is a mixed media piece by Melinda Schneider, Selfie 2022, part of a COVID series. Then we see Hope, an acrylic by Marie Prince with a similar theme. The corner pedestal has Fire Hole River, Yellowstone National Park by Ken Vick and Alkid Oil. Facing west again is Paula Borkowski's mixed media piece titled Post-Apocalyptic Sunrise. Finally, we have time to release an abstract acrylic by Brian Burbrick. The juror for this exhibition was well-known local artist Gary Wolf. His choices for awards are Merit Award to Bill McCullough for Not Our Maggie. Merit Award to Donna Hale for Don't Turn Your Back. Merit Award to Jane Stoddard for Tagged. Honorable Mention to Nikki Milley for Buffalo Chill. Honorable mention to Joan Langley Shaw for Canal Days. Special Dick Blick Award to Cass Schifano for Lily Pond at Reinstein Woods. Special Dick Blick Award to Dennis Bertram for Pan 3. Award of Excellence to Paula Jurek for Buffalo Skyway. Award of Excellence to Marie Prince for Hope. And Best of Show to Ken Vick for Sunset at Cow Pasture Pond, Archer, Florida. As amazing as this exhibition is, we invite you to come see them in person to really appreciate each work and each artist. We encourage everyone to think about owning an original piece of art to enjoy in their home. <music>